How lucky can you get? That is the question of the day today. We're going to watch a sovereign citizen who gets pulled over and released by the police for, well, a lucky reason, probably a one in 1,000 reason. So this interaction is funny, it's interesting, uh, and uh, I'm, I'm going to break down the sovereign citizen's uh, nonsense. Thank you everybody for tuning in. I'm Joe Palmetto, Joe the Lawyer, and this is the Common Sense Academy where we cover sovereign citizens and other wrongdoers. I'm an attorney. I break down their nonsense in a legal and interesting way. If you like my content, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. Also, ignore that sound that just came up on my phone. <laughs> also, I have another channel called Joe the Lawyer where I cover news in a legal way, mostly legal news, legal news analysis. You can sign up for my other channel. It is in the description below right at the top. Now, before we watch this video, raise your cup, your glass in the air. This is the real reason most of you come to see me is to enjoy a sip of your favorite beverage with my favorite beverage. Well, second favorite, but most most drunk beverage besides water, <laughs> Diet Coke. Cheers with me as we sip together. Cheers. <sighs> Delicious. All right, let's watch this sovereign citizen. <laughs> I'm fine. This is actually afternoon now. I'm Corporal Ethers going at police. The reason I stopped there is you go a little fast back there. How fast do you think you were going? How fast do you think I was going? Because um, last time I checked, um, there was no law that stands up by the United States Constitution that says speeding was a crime. And I wasn't trying to speed, so I'm not trying to make your day hard today. And I was not driving, I was okay. traveling, so I'm trying to figure out why you're pulling me over. Okay, well here's the deal. You were speeding. However, lucky for you, for some reason or other, my late user did not record the speed. Okay? I guess I'm a lucky so brother today. you are today, because I don't do not know why. Huh. But you were actually, when it popped up, for some reason or other, it did not lock it. You're doing 78 is what it flashed. That's what it flashed. But it did not lock up, okay? So, so you are required to follow the speed limit. Okay, I see what okay, you are required to have a driver's license. I, I don't understand. I don't understand. Let's hurry. That's it? Yeah. All right. Talk about lucky. What do you folks say? One in a thousand? One in a hundred? One in ten thousand? Listen, I'm a criminal defense attorney. I do traffic cases for people. I've never had an officer come in and tell me that the laser didn't work, all right? They all have it, uh, they all have it calibrated, okay? And they write down the exact miles per hour. Uh, very interesting interaction here. Very short video. I don't even know how it caught on the internet. Go check out Van Bayon's channel. But this sovereign citizen gets pulled over. The officer asks him, do you know how fast I was going? He says, here's a sovereign citizen tactic. Ask that same question back. No, officer, do you know how fast I was going? Da 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 da. Uh, and, and the officer starts to say that he was speeding and boom, the sovereign citizen comes right out. He says, there's no law under the constitution that says speeding is a crime. Guess what? He's actually right here. He's correct. There is nothing in the Constitution that says speeding is a crime. But what you need to know about the Constitution is there is nothing in the Constitution that prevents a local, state, or federal government from making speeding a crime. You see, that's ultimately what the Constitution is. The Constitution is a restriction on power. It creates the structure of our government, tells us how that government needs to work, and then restricts the power of government in certain areas. The, the Constitution doesn't write, it doesn't have affirmative criminal laws, okay? That's not how it works. That's not what this, the founding documents are about, all right? That's for individual legislatures to decide. So this sovereign citizen was right. However, his point does not go to defeating his case or the criminal law at all. At all. His, his statement can be true and he can still be caught speeding. So the officer then says that uh, he was going 78. We don't know what the speeding zone was. Was it in a 50? Was it in a 40? Was it in a 30? That matters. Um, and then he tells him that he didn't record the speed correctly. So uh, 
he, he's going to let go. He's going to be let go with a warning. Now, the interesting part of it, another interesting part of this transaction is the officer says at the end, you know, oh, you have to drive with a license. Why would he even say that? Why would that come out of his mouth? Well, because he knew that what came out of this driver's mouth was some sovereign citizen nonsense. And then this guy says, oh, can I go? Can I go? Uh, pressures the officer real quick and boom, gets to drive away. Now, that that police officer had the right to ask him to produce a license, all right, to produce a license. We all know that a, a lot of times, most of the times, or at least in the videos that we see, these sovereign citizens are driving around without a license. I always find it hilarious, some of these videos where they have their real license and a fake license, and then they give the fake license to the officer first, and then the real license just to play the game, just to prove their point or try and reinforce the sovereign citizen ideology. Then they can say, oh, my first my first license worked. No, it didn't work, okay? It's all BS. It's all nonsense. Um, this, guy, this guy sped off, and look, an officer may... You know, in a situation like this, give a warning and let the person go. Um, but he has the right to ask for that license. You know, I thought it was a little weird that it, he even blurted it out. Well, why didn't you ask for it, sir? Like, if it, why didn't you ask for it? He may be driving on a, a suspended license. Uh, maybe he already produced the license. Look, I don't know. I didn't see the whole video. But anytime the officers stop you for a traffic violation, they can ask to see your license. That's fair game. So thank you, everybody, for tuning in on another episode of the Constant Sovereign Citizen uh, soap opera uh, that we see here on this channel. It's entertaining. It's educating. And also uh, the Common Sense Academy, you know, we're here to remo remove some of the spin, hopefully deprogram some of these sovereign citizens or potential sovereign citizens listen if you're getting into it i'm telling you right now it's don't don't buy in don't buy in okay everybody thank you for tuning in i'm joe palmetto joe the lawyers of common sense academy please if you like my content check out my other channel joe the lawyer it's it the link is in the top of the description below i love you guys peace out